you were already thinking about your three people when Tyrone and Jack said that, right? Mm -hmm. You can all think about that, right? And so I just wanted to let you know, whatever you feel like this can do for you, it could. But if you're going to get in your own way, then you'll continue to get in your own way, right? You, f you probably have great ideas and great places that you would want to be in the next five to ten years, right? We all can agree with that, mm -hmm. right? So when you were younger, you had a dream of what you wanted to be when you were this age. When you were younger, you were three, you were five, you're like, when I'm 20, when I'm 18, I'm going to be this doing, I'm going to be this, this, and that, right? We all said that, right? But are we living that same dream when we were younger? No. But what happened? People told us things. That's dumb. Don't do that. You really going to do that? Well, how can you do this? How can you do that? It was a whole bunch of people telling us what we should be doing in our life instead of following that dream. So you're in the same position again, now that you're this age. You have an opportunity in front of you that can lead you to your greater opportunity. This is only a stepping stone to what we want to be. This allowed me to do public speaking now, right? This allowed me to be a mentor for the young kids that ain't DYS and all these other things to this. I don't have a college degree. They're making the same money that a person with a master's degree would have. So just think about what can this do for you? Can this change the circle around of people? If everyone in your family member, what's the last time you had this type of conversation with people that you know? Besides people you don't know, because you don't know any of us, but we'll open up our hearts to you. So with your best friends, have you ever had an intimate conversation when you talked about your dreams and goals? Mm. Probably mm. never. Mm. And that's okay. They don't have the same mindset as you. You all are individuals that are great. But if you're around people that aren't really mentally as fit as you are, it's going to downplay you. You probably have great ideas and wisdom. You want to share it. But when you share that conversation, they're like, yeah, that's cool. But where are you about to go tonight? <laughs> you to you feel me? So just know the people you surround, you can make not a dollar in this business, but if you surround yourself with us 24-7, you're going to be rich mentally. Mm -hmm. yes. mm -hmm. And then you're going to pass on to me. I'm like, Dad, you said that? Woo, I can learn from you. Mm -hmm. And there's going to be people that have your background, that have your background, that have your background, that have your background, that when you get into that, this business, you develop and you're speaking like this, and well, I could do it because she did it. I don't think about her. <laughs> you can't relate to me probably but you can relate to her the people in your network can relate to you but not me but think about this you're leading a whole pack of people mm. Martin Luther King was one person he led a whole pack of people mm. if you don't step forward who will right think about our family members do we have multi-millionaires in our family right now probably not if they, if they are they're not building to help us so we got to be that person that step forward. That's why this business is so hard, because we're trying to achieve something that no one has ever achieved in our family. So it's hard. People say no all the time. They don't want to join. It's going to be hard. Becoming a millionaire is kind of hard. <laughs> <laughs> that was told. Right? So just know that this is a stepping stone to where you want to be. We're not even five weeks. You just rough five weeks 24-7. This is a step that we're going to take to get to our dreams and our goals. But we're going to do it together. You have 20 people that's going to raise you to the top wow. while other people try to grab you down. Mm. So I would just say, think about what stood out to you. It was freedom. It was the environment that you was in. What was yours? I forget. That was what you just said. That's what I just said. A stepping on. stone. And yours was the new experience. Mm -hmm. So when you sit down, you say, do I want to do this? Think about this whole environment. And think about you standing up and speaking to new people. Mm -hmm. I was in the same seat you was in. You're going to tell somebody. And I was a little skeptical. Stu Tyrone was talking about how much money you made. I'm how much money you really made. Right? <laughs> <laughs> right? And you take your notes, you can remember this. You think about on the opposite side, 10 years later, you're like, wow, that was a great decision. Yeah. So take that with you tonight. Hope everyone drives safe. And thank you for coming out.